you know, at times you start thinking like I'm just here for a little bit instead of, and I'm going back to pit. But uh, no, it's starting to get settled in, become real, and uh, I'm excited about it. And it's been a lot of fun in just the past few days, and uh, you know, settling in really. Yeah, Joe's been a huge help. Can't thank him enough for that. And, um, yeah, just you know, talking to the guys, letting them know. Or they're letting me know how things are done, and uh, you know, just watching and learning. Really, I mean, uh, I mean, everything from coffee when you wake up to a bourbon at night. So it's everything in between too. Uh, you know, that's him. He he loves uh, the, the hospitality type stuff, and uh, he's really good at it. And you know, I'm happy to call him one of my buddies. The very first game, your game comes on a Tuesday night against the A's, and there was 40,000 people at Petco Park. What was what was that first game like for you? And just to see the sort of crowd that the Padres have now. Well, it was fun. Uh, place is electric. It's a lot of fun playing in front of that. And, um, you know, and then it being a Tuesday night says a lot about the fans in the city of San Diego. So, uh, you know, that, as a baseball player, that's what you want. That's what you get up for. That's what you live for. So uh, hopefully we got that again tonight. I'm sure that was the picture that was going on that night was uh, the look on your face after Tatis hits that home run. What did you think? What did you think of that shot? Oh, well, I mean, he hit it clear out of the stadium. So uh, not many guys can do that. And it was, I mean, I was just kind of in shock, really. How, how'd you do that kind of thing? And uh, I mean, to to be on base for that and get to watch it, pretty fun and happy I'm on uh, the same team as him. You don't really know Joe Musgrove, but how 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 are your other te- how are your teammates welcoming you in? Whether it's Manny Machado or Tatis and and Jake Cronin. No, I mean, they're all welcome with open arms. And, uh, you know, I've got to talk to those guys, playing against them over the years. Um, now we get to play with them and get to know them a little more. So, um, yeah, I mean, a lot of respect for every one of those guys just from playing against them on the other side. And uh, I think they felt the same. And it's, um, you know, they've welcomed me in with open arms, like I said. Different guys FaceTimed you on the on the plane, on the flight over from Pittsburgh. Uh, did I know Musgrove City FaceTime you? How many teammates, your new Padres teammates, jumped on that? Oh uh, no! I mean, you had Carantini and you and uh, Tatis. They're all you know jumping on, yelling at me. But uh, I was still in the clubhouse in San Francisco, so I didn't get to talk too long. Uh, but yeah, it was uh, it was just exciting, weird kind of moment as well, uh, leaving my teammates there and then being welcomed by by the new guys. So uh, yeah, it was a cool moment. Versatility is one thing, but where's your comfort zone as far as playing defensively? I know Jay said you're gonna first few games of being left field eventually at first but where do you see yourself playing I mean I'm comfortable in left comfortable at second um, you know I gotta get comfortable in right too because I think I'll be out there at times so um, I mean obviously second base because I played that the most but I'm you know I don't care where I play I don't care where I hit in the lineup it's uh, wherever I can help the team win and wherever Jace asks me to go play so um, you know like I said I'm just here to help the team win any way I can and looking forward to that you get some time with Bobby Dickerson. What's what's it like getting to know him? We've heard a lot about about his sort of personality, and I know a lot of guys say that he is one of the best coaches they've ever had. Yeah, um, I've had a lot of guys reach out to me, and Bobby D is the man. Um, he's, he's got the Mississippi ties with me, so we've already hit on that. I know his son's here today. My old roommate coached him last year at Southern Miss. So, uh, no, Bobby's great, and I look forward to getting to work with him and getting better on defense. And uh, you know, I'm just just excited about that too. What's your personality like? I mean, we still we can see what kind of player you are, but are, what are you like? Pretty laid back, pretty easy going. Uh, I don't show a whole lot of emotion, and uh, that's about it, really. I mean, I'm pretty pretty laid back. For a laid back guy, then is the swag chain going to fit with your demeanor and your style? Hopefully I can just play well enough to earn that, uh, putting that on. So um, it, this team's an exciting team. Uh, it's the most exciting team in baseball. It's the most fun team to watch. Happy to be here and happy to be able to join it. And uh, yeah, like I mean, I don't really care. <laughs> I want to. I'd love to put the swag chain on. So um, yeah, I mean it's fun.